I'm Carol Metal, Executive Director of the Gail Borden Public Library, and Denise Raleigh, who is Division Chief of Public Relations and Development. And Denise, what are we standing in front of here? What is this big blue bus? Uh, this big blue bus is our brand new bookmobile for Yay. Gail Borden Public Library. Yeah. <laughs> We now have a mobile branch, or we soon will be. We have to do a lot of work yet before we get it uh, on the road. Right. But it's here, and now we can start planning. How did we get this bus to Gail Borden Library? Well, it was quite an adventure. We picked the bus up in Ashland, Ohio, and we went through Indiana and Illinois, and we thought it'd be a fairly easy trip. Well, it turns out that was the day where we had terrifically high winds, we had snow, we had rain, we had a little bit of ice. So we thank the two bookmobile drivers that helped bring this. Uh, Dennis Raleigh, my son from Fountaindale Public Library, and Terry Scallon from Arlington Heights Memorial Library. She's the one who taught Dennis the bookmobile business. And when they weren't white knuckle driving, they were talking about how fabulous it is to bring bookmobile service to a community. So I hope you get a chance to see some of the Facebook uh, videos that we, that we had filmed as we crossed the country with the one that wasn't driving. Um, <laughs> but it was, it was a lot more challenging than what yeah. we had anticipated. Well, there was a small crowd here. We were, we were anticipating it might come between 4 and 5.30 last Saturday, but it came about 6.15. And we were so excited to see it round the corner yeah. because we know what this is going to be able to bring to the community. We will have a mobile branch that will bring our services out within our 65 square miles of our library district. Oh, it's going to be fantastic. So you will see if you watch some of that video from our arrival that there was a kind of a zombie Lincoln. And that yeah. was Councilman John Steffen, who also is a member of the Kiwanis Club who we are very, very appreciative and grateful for because they are supporting uh, our being able to bring this bookmobile to our community. So thank you, Kiwanis. Yeah, and they have a long tradition. They supported our readership band. Yes. And so their support for literacy has been outstanding and we are so proud to have the Kiwanis on the side of this uh, bookmobile. The other big funder, of course, right now is our... Is our Gail Borden Public Library Foundation. And they have supported it from the get-go, and we are just so grateful for them, too. Of course, who made the decision was our Library Board of Trustees. So thank you, trustees. Uh, they certainly saw the need and uh, what this bookmobile could bring to our community. And I think we use the term game changer. Yes. And, yeah. and how, just in a real shortly, how, why is this bookmobile going to be such a game changer here? Because it's going to enable people to receive library services that are unable to get to our main library or two branches. We're going to bring the library to them. And we are going to be determining where those best spots are uh, that we can reach the most people that do have uh, challenges getting here to a building and that we can bring books and DVDs uh, to them and um, we are certainly going to be uh, um, uh, emphasizing the services to our children. That's what Kiwanis was so interested in because their mission is all about serving children too. There's going to be chances to support the collection. We're still fundraising for the collection. So uh, again, you can contact Carol or myself if you're interested in supporting the collection that's gonna go on this bookmobile. But we'll be talking about this bookmobile for, from, for many uh, days to come. We're just so excited that it is here. It's, it's home now. It is home now. It is home now. And so stay tuned as we uh, complete everything we need to do before we roll it out onto the streets. Yeah. And if you watch a little bit of that video, I loved Terry Scallon's line where she said, uh, a bookmobile is like an ice cream truck, only better. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so this is going to be wonderful. It's going to be wonderful.